Hey, what's going on over? Fuck, that was that. I'm flipping just that quickly. Don't do that again. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Listen, it's not considering how you don't do it. Shut up. I should keep Yo, this. Yo, man. I should we definitely five keep this. episodes in. You shouldn't should have a fail of breath I'm with your this. intro. Everything, I'm keeping this all of this. Fuck you. All right. I'm keeping all of this. Fuck you. Now, I'm sorry, sorry. We're going to try this again. I'm keeping all of this. I, li- I liked it. It was, it was authentic. I'm sorry. <sighs> hey, what's going on, everyone? Thank you for coming back with us for another round. Of course, you know you have the infallible bass, old dirty dick slinging Vel, oh, yo, you trifling bitch. <laughs> God, <this laughs> That's why your name is trifling ass bash. Damn. Okay. Damn. Can we get to the God. intro first? We, we, we gonna we gonna get to all the bashes later. A woman. Was... Uh, quiet, you. I'm introducing probably the most influential and important person of the whole podcast. Like, Jesus Christ, this chick is so bad, nigga, I almost went over there a couple of times to pull up on her. Tamika. Hello, everyone. And... Ski. Oh, so now you just not here, nigga? Wait, what happened? I said your name. I didn't even hear a single <laughs> Oh, exactly. for real? Oh, exactly. Oh, my fault. Okay, okay. All right. I apologize. I, I, I thought I said it. I guess I really didn't get no fucks about you. Really. Okay, back and ski. Yo, oh. if I wasn't <laughs> someone who actually grew up and fucked with you, like what? I would violate your whole family every day. <laughs> <laughs> You just a nigga that. You a tough nigga that. You don't touch him. You you violate his family members oh, so he know to stop man. fucking playing with you. So they oh. could be mad at him like, yo, you made him do this to us. You understand what I'm saying? Damn. Shit. Damn. Huh? That was hard, Ski. I didn't even know it was like that. My fault, my fault. Now, nah, fuck this whole nigga right here. I don't get no shits about him now. <laughs> Back to what I was saying. We going, today we're going to be, today we going to be discussing divorce, which is going to be our first topic. The second one is going to be home cooking. And, you know, third topic is, well, it's going to be birth control. You know what I'm saying? We, we switching up. We ain't, you know, we got to be all sexual with us. You know what I'm saying? We got depth. You know what I'm saying? We got, we get deep in this motherfucker. Deep. Right? That's what I'm talking about. And then, you know, of course, we got everybody's favorite segment after that third topic, which is birth control is in the cut, featuring the amazing Tamika and the fuck nigga that she usually talks to. Ooh, your intros suck. Fuck nigga you right there. You the fuck. suck. You hear the fuck nigga energy coming out of her right now? Yo, if y'all, I'm going to let you finish the intro on, though. Go ahead, continue. Oh, I, I thought I was done. I'm sorry, go on. Nah. Oh, okay, so... What's good, y'all? I'm Ski. Um, if y'all want, please hit us up at Another Round Podcast, 808 at gmail.com slash fire the host. Fire the host. <laughs> <laughs> because this, this dude right here is dude dude. Oh, mm. I'm sorry. I mean, I, I entertain myself, nigga. That's all that counts. Uh, we don't want to know if you play with yourself, please. Keep that shit to yourself, bro. Like, yo, what the I hell? swear. One of these days, I'm going to violate your inbox, nigga. You better stop. Mm. Yo. I'm, I'm forwarding that shit straight to the I'm forwarding that shit straight to the police. <laughs> I'm forwarding that shit straight to the police, bro. I mean, I always gotta be like, yo, what's up with yo? This podcast this turned niggas into snitches. Here. Like this podcast yo, definitely Tukas got niggas came wanting home to. Home got away with it. Fuck that. Ah, uh, they just mm. can't tell me nothing. All right, that's gonna be a topic we gonna discuss later on too. Oh yeah, we definitely gonna yeah. have to talk mm-hmm. about that. All right. This is bad, man. Oh, man. All right, go for it. The intro is probably my favorite part. Okay. I'm sorry, everyone. So, we're going to get right into it like we usually do with our first topic, which is divorce. 
And I I hate always going to this nigga, so we're gonna start off with Mika. Mika, what you think about divorce? I think divorce, if for the right cause, is the best thing for a couple to go through. Instead of fighting and arguing, carrying on, acting crazy, you know, beating each other the fuck up and all that stuff like that. If divorce is the final thing they can do or the right thing they can do, they need to do it. Now, I don't know how much divorce is because I plan not to get married after what I learned from the last show. Mm. So I feel <laughs> like divorce, if that's your thing, you need to go ahead and just go ahead and get the fuck away, get on with your life, do what you need to do. Divorce quickly, too. Don't divorce drag that quickly. shit out for four or five months, four or five years, all that blase bull right off like a band-aid. That's my thoughts on divorce. That's your thoughts on divorce. Val, what's up with you? What you think about divorce? Um, I pretty much feel the same way Mika feels about divorce, but I like I don't know. Like my thing is, I just don't believe in marriage. I'm sorry, I'm never gonna get married. Don't think I, none of that shit is for me. So yeah, to each his own. If you feel like you want to get married, that's what you do. But I'm just never gonna do it. Mm-hmm. And that's it. <laughs> sorry. Uh huh. Nah, I mean, well, I'm we 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 don't get fuck about that other nigga. We was gonna do him last time, that from last time. So, I'm going to speak now. I feel like, yeah, divorce. So is... what I was saying was, <laughs> fuck this funny head ass nigga, uh... right? First off, yeah. What are we? What's the topic? Shut up. Divorce, Negro. You should oh, know, as expert. A, listen to me, right? As a divorce here. Divorce. You know divorce. Divorce. Sorry to hear that. No, you're not. I mean, yo, you know what? To be honest with you, like you just said, it's better to let go and take your losses before you you start to resent, hate. You know what I mean? Get, especially when kids is involved. Yes, that shit yes, gets real yes. ugly and real disgusting. Yes, I yes. personally don't believe... No, I can't say I don't believe in divorce. It wasn't my idea to get divorced. Aww. But I definitely was done with the, the marriage, though. Oh, okay. So it's like, yo, what's best for two individuals? It makes sense. Cause what y'all gonna do? Kill each other? Y'all gonna sit around there and violate disrespect? And the kids see that. Like, you know what I'm saying? They go through it. Fuck what y'all going through. The little ones go, nah. If you ain't married, hell no. Torture that bitch life. Don't mm. do shit. You ain't going nowhere, ho. You're never gonna be happy. Are you stupid? Oh. Let's go to counseling. You belong to me. Fuck you talking oh, about. Okay. But when the kids is involved, yeah, let it go. Let Another it go, round go. podcast does not believe in the reviews that Ski has. So please, please, divorce quickly. Don't no, marry another, him. Yeah, another <laughs> round does quickly. believe in what I. What well, I'm I don't about. believe in that shit that you just said. Yes, you do. <laughs> No, the it hell just, I don't. You just told me the other day you would marry me if I had oh, no money. Boy, oh, boy, bye. Shit. Oh, boy, wow. bye. Golden dreams at IG. Slash <laughs> golden slash dreams gold, at IG. Boy, slash, bye. Slash gold digger. Gold digger productions. <laughs> oh. Boy, bye. You just finished just finish telling me, Ski, I would have married you, you know. you And now this, you don't believe it. You and Bella is both fake, first of all. <laughs> Let me let me just tell you up front. First of all, I'm not I'm not I'm not fake. Because I don't believe in marriage. I just don't believe in marriage. Like for me, I'm sorry. I don't think I'm ever gonna. I don't think I ever want to be married. Val, you was engaged seven times. You're a damn lie. I ain't never been engaged. You trifling ass nigga. You don't start with me. Yo, Ooh. I heard you was engaged seven times. This is true. Well, yeah, guess Bash what? said that. This is Bash, Bash said that. Jack. That's a fact. Yeah. Well, first, of all, first of all, you okay. listen to trifling ass Bash all you want to. That nigga wake up every morning just to lie. Damn, Ooh, my damn. He don't even wake up the, the, the breeze. He just wake up the No, <laughs> that's what he is. All of that lies. I don't appreciate lies. all of the Ooh. fucking slander for no reason. Like, <sighs> Jesus Christ, my nigga. Leave me alone. I've never been engaged. Ain't never been trying to hear that bullshit. Nigga, you know, the grapevine said, and the grapevine is Bash, said that you <laughs> were engaged seven different times, my dude. Seven nope, times. Never. Seven? Come on, bro. Seven times? 
Never been was, engaged. I hope, it was, I hope it was seven different women because if you engage the same bitch seven times, you was a bozo. Mm. Never been engaged. Sorry. It's never I'm happened. Bozo out here, nigga. Well, Bash, next time that you gossip, please make sure your information is correct. All right. So the next Matter time fact, I'll tell y'all some next imaginary Next week we're coming out with the gossip with. corner with Bash. The gossip corner. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I fuck with that. I'm telling all I'm, y'all niggas business. Fuck out of here, son. That's what's up. We gonna, yeah. you, Gossip you Corner with own... Bash. Fuck that in the cut session thing. That's going to be me. Or me, That's my segment, all nigga. you by yourself. Cutting these niggas' asses, son. Left like when right you're making love office. by yourself. <laughs> Wait, so I'm going to have a pension with you, Ski? Huh? Nah, mm-hmm. Don't worry about it. So, yeah. No, I didn't, um, I didn't Gossip hear you. I didn't corner. hear you. <laughs> but I know you said some trifling <laughs> shit. So, yeah. Just, so, um, Gossip, 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 um, Gossip Corner with me on the next episode. Get, look look forward to it, people. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yes, come, yes. Coming next week. Coming next week. Coming Period next week. poo. Yes, yes. Go ahead. Week. Real quick. Real quick. <laughs> yes, yes. All right, now, back back to this divorce shit. I get sidetracked a lot. Vel? All your many failed marriages. I mean, all your imp- but what you like to say? First of all, look at look at you, trifling mm-hmm. bitch. Yo, you what? Don't leave me the fuck alone. Just, so you gotta listen. Yeah. You gotta stop being so hostile. So I'm acting. Yeah, what do you think about the boy? Why nigga? the fuck y'all niggas yeah, like, here so angry, yo? Yo, right? <laughs> look here. I can't stand this nigga here. He ain't yo. never <laughs> shit. He ain't never gonna be shit. Mm. I'm with. I ain't gonna lie, with ba- mm-hmm. Bell. I'm with you on that mm-hmm. one. I can't yeah. stand this piece of shit, motherfucker, yo. Damn. But anyway, back to divorce. Damn. Let's talk about the six divorces Bash gonna get if he ever get married. Mm, why you gotta divorces? be six? Because he First gonna of... keep getting married. Bash slow as shit. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> he gonna keep doing it. I'm gonna let you know thinking now. the next one could perfect it. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen, listen. If I get married, nigga, I ain't getting divorced. It's a death do us part, bitch. And I'm getting life insurance on all of y'all. Fuck out of here. Oh, you want to leave? It's only one way out. This motherfucker is death. Only one way out. Only one way and out. And it says it in the Bible. Can I do? Do I need to quote something else? <laughs> <laughs> nah, we, do ain't, I, we, ain't, we ain't doing. Do all I that. need we to quote? Oh, that. all right. I was just asking. We do I need to quote something? Else? We ain't doing all that, nah. Yeah. Especially, um. Nah. We ain't doing all that. I don't want to get married anymore. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. No. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. Nah, for real. I, I honestly, when it comes to divorce, I mean, shit, it happens. I don't see it as a negative thing. Mm-hmm. If you, if you honestly don't want to stay with somebody and you realize the relationship isn't what it was and it's toxic, get the fuck out of here. But marriage, mm-hmm. I think marriage is fine though. I think marriage is ill. Like a mm-hmm. ceremony. I don't like the whole. I guess you could say the federal or governmental aspect to it when like you combining both of your finances. I, I like this ceremony though. Like to let all of your family, friends, and loved ones know that this person means that much to you that y'all are willing to go through this whole commitment process. I, I want to pre know. Let me sidebar if I wow. ever decide to. Wow. I love, I love I wanna, when women say this stupid I want a prenup. I do want a prenup. Like, wow. you know what? What the fuck do you got for a prenup? First of all, fuck that. Whatever <laughs> happens. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. You're fucked up. I feel like, you know, because, all right, I'm speaking on behalf of the fact of I do have sons. I have sons. And if they decide they want to make their money and stuff like that, get some kind of wealth to fame or whatever the fuck the case may be i feel like they need to protect themselves so like i would condoms? want prenups too oh, oh <laughs> like, my fault my fault i don't know where fresh the fuck i was just now at the other podcast <laughs> fucking prenups like i feel i don't have a problem with a prenup a nigga could make me sign a prenup i don't have a problem with that so you'll sign a prenup but he can't have sex with you when he want to when you're married some Listen, we're not going back to the last thing we discussed with the other time. I'm on for, I'm on for, y'all. I'm on for, y'all. I'm on for, I'm on for. We're not doing that. We're going, not for. going back. Hell the fuck no. <laughs> you can sign, I can sign a prenup. No, keep I'm not a, a prenup. Keep your prenup. Keep your prenup, nigga. I'm not signing. To all the women who know, I'm not signing no prenup. You good. You ain't letting them go, neither. <laughs> you that's your enough. box and that's it and it's that's all what it. I'm saying so what's the point of the prenup there's no point in the prenup you're not going nowhere mm. 
Yeah, well, I, listen, like I said, I ain't mad at you, but you ever seen the movie The Invisible Man? Ski, I think you should see that movie. <laughs> that was an all right movie. That shit was it loosely was. based on his life. You know that, right? It was. It was a real nice oh, movie. Life, on my life? Yeah. <laughs> nah, my life has never been that exciting. That bitch life wasn't exciting either when that mom was taking her ass. To that nigga start making her life interesting. He made her life real interesting oh, real oh, quick. Oh, the new shit that came out. Yeah. 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 Where that nigga hate. Oh, I wanted to see that too. Is that good though? For real? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That shit, yeah. yeah. I see, I've seen that shit like three times. You're giving me <laughs> Invisible Man vibes right now. <laughs> like, I swear. <laughs> like, like, the man ain't going nowhere. I'll be it's honest with you. If I torment a bitch, I am not going to try to concoct an invisible potion. I want you to see me, ho. You gonna see me, <laughs> first, ho. First, first of all, she knew it was this nigga. Nowhere. She knew it was but this she nigga. She kept, te- <laughs> she yeah, kept telling it, people, like, this nigga's out here. to drive that nigga crazy, <laughs> drive her crazy, right? I don't want to drive you crazy. I'm not you trying want to make to, you drive. You want, I you want me to know, know that y'all crazy. That's it. You're not going mm. nowhere. Mm. So enjoy whatever you think you're enjoying. It's a dub, shorty. Nowhere will you go, Sykes. That's it. You lied. Oh, you out with your girls, Psych. Damn. Okay. You can't go out with our friends. Nah, no. <laughs> Yo, everyone has listen. I just be joking. I don't no, be caring that much. He means all that shit. I don't be caring that much. He's dead ass. He means all that, that, that shit. About Y'all know how them niggas be beating women, these bitches. You know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't care that much about a woman and her personality, her, her situations like that. I like my women to be free thinking and free flowing. Do your thing. Nah. I'm not about to cage you. None of that shit. There's too much women out here for that. Damn, now, man. when I'm like questions, 70. Any questions, comments, or complaints, you know? When I'm like Email 70, us. though, that's different. <laughs> have another round podcast, 808 at gmail.com. You can just be up here lying for no reason. Key. What is that talking about? <laughs> yeah, he was engaged seven fucking times. <laughs> I ain't never been fucking engaged. Ain't nobody you, Ski. You or that nigga, mm. Badge? I was in, <laughs> listen to me. I was engaged one and a half times. One and a half, nigga. I, I feel, I feel like that's a lie. I feel like it's a lie. No one in the whole half times. Nope, that I feel like know. it's a lie. That nigga know. I feel like it's a lie. Whole half out here. I feel like there's a whole fucking a whole what fucking lie. Whole fucking lie. Y'all so fucking lie. evil. Mickey, you never been proposed to? <sighs> no, no, no. What? I don't believe that. Why you don't believe it? I am probably a very evil person on the low. <laughs> I know. Like, I be friendly as shit. I probably tell my niggas are radiators. They can't go outside, so out. Like, you don't know. Out. Wait, yeah, what? That's why he would propose, because you don't force him to propose. This nigga don't even know what he's doing. <laughs> he over there down on one knee, didn't know he was locked to the radiator, but he proposed. Yo. <laughs> Just like that I... Stockholm Syndrome? Yeah, oh, the cockroach. We're not getting into that. No, we're not, not getting, getting into that. that no, no, we're not getting into that. That's for another show and another time. Another but time. why you never? I've never been proposed. That you do to people. <laughs> I, I have never been proposed. I would like to propose to somebody though. Wait, I, I want to get on one knee. I want to somebody? get on one knee. I wouldn't oh, have a problem with that. Oh yeah, I like that. We could we could talk about that another time, but I yeah, that's another, don't have that's a problem. Another thing too. That's another thing too. I wouldn't have a problem doing it, you know. Wonder World Girls, you know, I wouldn't have a problem doing it. So, what okay, else are we okay, moving okay. along to? No, Bash didn't finish saying his point. I cut him off. Go ahead, Bash. Oh, okay, go ahead. I don't remember my point no more. Oh, Let's man. Start from, the, start from the beginning, bro. I don't remember what the fuck I was talking about. He don't remember what he was talking about, period. He really um, wasn't talking about shit, but you know. You know what? Go suck a no dick, nigga. I know what I was talking about. Yo, this nigga loving love men, boy. I don't, I don't understand this shit with this guy, bro. Yo, you know what? I can't, even, I can't even tell you the reasoning behind that shit because I'm going to get canceled. I'm gonna get canceled. I don't, don't want to get canceled. You can't no, tell us the no. reason why you it's don't a bunch like of men. Gay people out here. No, no. why he like men? No, he's not no. like no, no. The reason I told why he like men. No, nah, no. Nah. You know what it is. You know what? I look at it no, like the... this. I'm a no, because this is a whole different topic. Chill. 
Plus, I'm not yeah, trying to get canceled because these niggas. All right, listen. I have nothing against homosexuals. Real talk. I don't get. I mean, okay. your sexual preference is all you, a hundred percent, all the way. Do whatever makes you happy, and things like that. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got. I, I, I know. I I know. I use sucking cock as an insult to other people, and that that oh. is a reflection on my personal preference. Because it's not something I would ever find enjoyable in wait, life. Wait, wait, wait. So your personal preference is sucking cocks? No, that's why it's an insult for you, which is something I want you to do, nigga. Oh, you hear that? I want one down your throat so far that you jog every time you snort, nigga. Like, shut up. Now. Yo, he is cracking you up, yo. You said it yourself, yo. your personal preference. I said, I said it is not my personal preference. It's bobbing for wieners. <laughs> oh, he is. Out of control. Yeah. Out of control. <laughs> no, yo, why are is you... he trying to get me canceled for real, for real? He, I knew one day this nigga trying to set finally, me up. You would finally me. just be real with us. And yeah. I appreciate you, Dash. Yo, you here? I you applaud you for me? coming out of the closet, Dash. I applaud First you. First of all, listen, huh? I ain't in. Let's stop, yo, because you really trying to get me canceled. Like, again, I have no problem with anybody's sexual <sighs> preference. You know what I'm saying? It is. <sighs> and again, I do not mean nothing by it. Like, just because I consider it an insult. No, I don't consider it an insult. I'm just saying, I don't mean nothing by it. I'm, I don't know fucking talk. No, no, I'm good. I ain't got nothing to say. Divorce is, divorce is a thing that happens to people. It is what it is. Fuck it. Yeah, I'm good. I think it's kind of sad, too. You know, a lot of couples, especially in the African uh, American community, like, when they get to the table of divorce, they're not trying to work it out. I feel like they need to go like people need to seek counseling there's a reason why you went yo matter of fact correction i think people need to seek counseling before they get married they have mm-hmm. that you're supposed to actually niggas don't do it but you are supposed no, to certain churches I, that's not real that's not real counseling the pastor wants to see you real quick before he gives his yeah. blessing to marry you but it's bullshit because oh. when i went my my ex was violating me in that motherfucker boy mm. That shit was the funniest shit. We pulled up before we went inside. She was like, yo, we're not going to tell him our business. We just want to, as soon as we walked in there, yeah, because he be, and he be, I'm looking at her like, he be, and he be. (laughs) You (laughs) this bitch right here. And he still married us. So (laughs) that shit fake. I mean, real deep tissue counseling. I feel like. What's the average time of 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 engagement? I don't know. Does anybody know? No. I have mm. no clue. Is it an option or like as opinion or what is no, the no. time? No, no, no. I'm asking. I think maybe a year. I think it's oh, roughly a year. I think statistics do say it's roughly a year. I'm trying to find my fucking to double check that. It would be but, a year, right? Because it takes you yeah, a while to plan this Yeah, I think that's the machine. average time for an engagement, but. Let's say it's a year. We're going to go with a year. I think in that year time, six months out of the year, y'all should be going to counseling for you to get married. So at least y'all understand the whole concept of becoming one. Because motherfuckers get married and they're still with their same single people bullshit. Mm. Uh-huh. You're not trying single to conform. Yeah. You're not trying to conform. You're not trying to even budge a little bit. You're doing a lot of sneaky. And I'm not talking about like cheating. I'm just saying the shit that you used to do when you were single. You can't no longer do that with a wife or a husband. You understand what I'm saying? Y'all are supposed to move as one, united. So I think if they get some kind of way. Yo, we enforcing this into law. Like, before y'all get married, you have to do six months of counseling. Mm, speak on it. Mm, mm-hmm. Get that embedded nigga. in your situation, and you will have a, a less of a divorce rate like we got now. Yeah, that sounds true. Yeah. It would be helpful. I mean, I think it would be helpful. I don't think it's going to stop divorce, but yeah, it would definitely help. Mm. Nah, but you think... You, it's all right. It's not gonna stop divorce, right? No way. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna help you, saying. But <clears throat> excuse me, sorry, y'all. What happened here? Re- <laughs> um, COVID. So, mm, mm, 
Mm. <laughs> we throw his mic out after every session, because that nigga just disgusting. Continue. <laughs> So they so the thing is, well, I lost my whole train of thought with that bullshit, yo. <laughs> I hate talking to this guy, yo. Oh, for real? I wonder what the fuck that's like. <laughs> Piece of shit. So, it, all right. And and right now in America, right, the divorce mm-hmm. rate is when I checked last, it was like forty yeah. percent. The divorce rate in America is forty percent. 40% is high. That's all mar- um, out of marriages. That's crazy high. What was the purpose of you getting married in the first place if you're nearly at 50%? How much billions of people live in America? How much hundreds of millions of people are married? Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? So you're telling me 40% of that people are calling it quits and you're getting divorced? It's something behind that. We're not getting the structure that we used to get back in the days. We need some kind of help. A motherfucker needs to know how to sustain another person in their atmosphere. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? Like we got to be able to break our own selves down and be able to absorb another person's good side and their bad side. Otherwise, what the fuck is the point of getting married? I think no, divorce no. is the stupidest shit in the world. I think if we gonna suffer, we just gonna have to suffer together. Fuck Mm-mm. this. That shit dumb. Mm-mm. Suffer by yourself, baby. I'm out of here. <laughs> we suffering mm. together. I'm out of here. And this is Fuck this that. is me talking like I ain't get a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> exactly right, like yeah. Okay, so moving on from that, divorce is bad. Get out divorce quick. Divorce is bad. Get out divorce, quick. Divorce? How you gonna say divorce is bad? Get out quick. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> so we do not we do not support the views of Tamika. <laughs> you understand? Another round podcast I'll does not saying. support. Get out quick. Some people drag divorces. I know a guy that was. Trying to get a divorce for like fifteen years, like that shit. shit is expensive. It's and it's cheap. expensive, but it's like yeah. damn. That's another reason why you need to just stay married. Fuck that. Stay married because it costs bread. Yeah, just do your thing. I don't give a fuck no more. I'ma do me, you do you. Nah, you can nah, live over nah. here. I'ma live over here. And that's nah. it, yo. I'm not paying for that. Shit, crazy, bro. Hell no. Yo, Vel, when you got dumped all seven times from your engagement, right? Cause that's Look at me, don't start that book. dumb shit huh? with me again. Don't start that dumb shit again. Damn. I'm not you. Yeah, but that's I'm not Vash you, said. nigga. Vash I don't said. give a shit what Vash <laughs> say. You have to tell Vash to stop gossiping when you're not yeah, around. Yeah. <laughs> like, and then said. tell her to get, get the right information. You see this? And I give her good intros. Y'all see how they do me, niggas? I'm like, just saying. I give her good intros. Them. See, when I gossip yeah, about people, I I try to get actual factuals. Mm. <laughs> so it won't be no saying. no fucking fallback no stuff. Yeah. Yeah, like he acting hostile. Like this is all untrue, man. She gotta change it up. Change it up. I don't know what y'all talking about. Yes. Now moving along. <laughs> all right. So yeah, you just be moving in to the next topic. Um, which is going to be home cooking. Um, <laughs> little curveball in it, home cooking. Y'all yeah, expect that, right? Uh huh. Home cooking. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Home yeah, cooking. Um, well, ski. I'm just gonna since, throw this shit no, away. No, no. Since she, since she's moving us along, go ahead, Mika. Nah, I asked, her, I asked her first last time, nigga. I'm asking you, home cooking. Fuck out of here. Um, oh yeah, you the one who got the home cooking, you know, you get home cooked meals. Yeah, right? home cooking, Steve. Oh, stop. First of all, y'all stop telling my business, okay? Wait, stop Maybe telling you know. my business. I, 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 I appreciate if y'all just stop talking about my life, you feel me? Maybe you first both get all, home cooking. Maybe you got the food in a bowl on the floor. He get home cooked <laughs> meals and don't invite nobody to his house. Mm-hmm. Y'all, don't live, damn so. y'all don't live in this motherfucking home. You want home cooking? Go to your motherfucking kitchen. How about that? I ain't, I ain't got no home. I ain't got no home. Uh, that sounds personal. <laughs> mm. <laughs> this nigga, this nigga ain't yeah. shit. 
Mm. Nigga ain't shit. Nigga try to make mm. make me do extra work. <laughs> what? Mm-mm. How like am I making you do extra work? Cause I'm trying because to get a meal. I gotta. Set, Cause yeah, I'm trying I gotta to get a set meal. A whole next mm. plate. You no. ain't got. You ain't gonna. You ain't gonna set the plate. I know you ain't. Cause you ain't shit. Damn. Mm-hmm. I hope Let you all enjoyed how. another round. The next episode will be called Fates. <laughs> fakes? Mm. To represent the cast in this motherfucker. <laughs> Ain't nothing but a bunch of fakes. So, you mm. know what I'm saying? I hope y'all enjoyed this very last episode of another round. Continue, fake ass nigga ski. Home mm. cooking. Mm. Wait, why am I? Yo, hold up. Alright, now I'll get back to that later. So, home cooking. First of all, I'm African. Nah, I'm so, not you don't sl- get home I'm, cooking? No, no, I'm not a slave. I'm African. My parents come from Ghana. They came here on their own free will. Mm-hmm. Understand? So yes. back home, our tradition is taught that we are to be taken care as the male are supposed to be taken care of by our counterpart, our woman. Our, uh, even up to now, my mother will still, if I step in the crib, take care of my older sister. That's how it is. So home cooked food is a must. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Not only must you have a woman who knows how to handle herself in the kitchen, but me mm-hmm. as a man, I need to know how to take care of it myself. You understand? Outside food, fast food, all that shit is cute. Mm. But no, home cooked food is a must. Like, that's a must, mm. must. Home cooking, that's a must. <sighs> Ain't no mm-hmm. side ifs, ands, or buts about it. You dating a woman and she can't, she can't throw down in the kitchen? Then... There's no real future. For me, ain't no real future in that. And I'm not saying the weight of a man's heart is to his stomach because I heard that before, but it's not that. It's just the little things of upbringing that people need. Mm-hmm. Plus, home cooking is better for you physically anyway with all the bullshit that be added to these outside foods. All right. I mean, it seems like you have more to say. That's all you have to say on it. For me? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm good. I'm, yeah, I'm good. I know. Yo, the way some of y'all in y'all shit. I know all of y'all shit. niggas suffer. <laughs> y'all don't get home cooked food. Nobody cares about y'all. I know that. Yo, the way <laughs> some of y'all end off sentences is like open <laughs> statement. But all right. So My that bad. was sorry. That was, now nah, 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 we're nah, going nah. with the education again. I thought I told you about this last episode. Mm. Stop talking to me with your Ben Franklin. <laughs> I don't know. Okay? Mm-hmm. okay. All right? All right. <laughs> with your proper English and all this, put period behind the sentence, all that. Stop that. Okay? I know where you live. Thank you. No. Damn. Please. You, that's that's kind of like we... a, a, a third threat where he live. Like, uh, I don't know. Listen. <laughs> Yo, if, if, what's uh, up? If an ancient nigga threatened you, it's not a threat. Now, Val, yes. What do you think about like like home cooking, nigga? What's up with you, like? Um, I prefer to eat at home. I don't like all the fast food, like Ski was saying before. But food. yeah, <laughs> you, just, you know, you don't like all the fast food. Yeah, oh, that's that. right, the I fast hate. food, nigga. The fast food. That's mm-hmm. right, nigga. Yeah. So that's right. Yeah, the shit that makes us laugh is fucking retarded. I swear to God, shit that makes us laugh is retarded. So yeah, I uh, pretty much I know how to cook. I cook my own. I can cook my own goddamn meals if necessary. But oh, eh. finally. Hey, first of all, shut up. Nah, I'm I'm getting trapped, you nigga. I'm trying to make that statement forever. Always mm-hmm. fronting like he can't cook. He ain't got no mm-hmm. food. Now we hear this. I could cook. Oh, I could cook my own meals if I want to. Fuck. Yeah, that's why I can. Yeah. I went and checked Vel one time. Vel threw down in the kitchen. Real hospitable. Yo, he a fake. He's real hospitable, yo. Mm-hmm. Open his doors for niggas. Mm-hmm. Come chill. Come, we're going to go to the supermarket. I'm going to cook what y'all want to eat. Mm-hmm. So, oh, all right. First of all, I I fuck with you, Val. No, I did. I don't remember none of this shit. He lined Mm, his motherfucking ass off. Mm, mm. Usually, real hospitable, hospitable. No, 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 Steve. I'm sorry. Listen, I don't mean to put this nigga business out here, but with the nigga you have met before was a whole different nigga in a whole different time zone. Like you know what I'm saying? 
once you come, once you a New York nigga, all of that fuck shit go out the window. He don't do none of that no more. Because I heard some stories. I wanted to go check this nigga where he was somewhere and he was somebody that was doing shit. But once you get to New York, you ain't shit nigga no more. Trust me, I know. I fuck with all of y'all. So, yeah, he don't do none of that no more. Continue. Damn. Anyway, like I said, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. I, I, I just worry about myself. All that other going out to restaurants, nah. nah I'm, not, I'm not about that life. Mm-hmm. Okay. As, as 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 for myself, I know how to cook. <laughs> I, oh, cool. word, word. How many? Long, how long you been owing meals? I don't give a fuck how many meals <laughs> I owe. I know how to cook, and Wait. I um. Wait. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Talking. When there's someone to cook for, I will cook. Ooh. Wait, what the fuck? Like you, you said you were gonna cook. <laughs> you said <laughs> don't tell nobody you gonna cook and then don't cook. What kind I, of shit is that? But I be having my moments, you know. So and one of these moments, gotta wait, catch me. When don't I'm tell me. Don't tell me catch you when you ready to cook. Guy ass all the damn time, and you ain't never ready to cook. And then when you do cook, you still don't invite nobody over. <laughs> Cause I don't be cooking shit. Like that's enough for everybody. <laughs> like I be wait, cooking little, wait. little bullshit stuff. Uh, now is little bullshit stuff. Yo. Yeah, little bullshit stuff. You know, nobody want to eat that little bullshit stuff I be cooking. You know. Okay. Damn. Oh, yo, the way y'all finish off things. Okay. Yeah, right. I, I, like you, I, you thought she was gonna say something else, right? <laughs> I yeah, thought she I really... was too. She, I, all right, man. All right, my fault, my fault, my fault. Okay. So, all right, so me, um, fuck it, my turn then. All right, but home cooking, I fucks with it. I don't like my home cooking per se. People generally like it, but I feel like a lot of a lot of people that cook never like their own cooking. I don't know. I don't like my own cooking. Yeah, I, I don't my like my own, own cooking. cooking. I don't like my own cooking. I might be wrong. That's just the fucking delicious. Shut up. Like I said, I don't I don't like my own cooking. But then another thing is I don't really like other people to cook for me. I like to cook for myself. It's weird. It's not that I don't trust other people's cooking. It's just I don't know. I, I prefer I prefer to cook my own meals, if you get what I'm saying. Or if I'm not cooking my own meals, I would like to go out and dine as a break and shit like that. I don't, I I just really don't trust women in the kitchen, my nigga. Like, I don't know. You ain't putting no root on me, nigga. Like I say a lot of shit and Did you yeah. say root? <laughs> <laughs> the boy said root. I don't say listen, you know, I don't I don't want nothing on me, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't eat nothing red that a woman makes after talking to my mother's shit. Like don't ever let if a woman make you something red, don't eat that shit. Listen, I don't fuck with mm-hmm. it. She put the little drop of that, you know what in there, nigga. And I'd be like, yo, this this food smell familiar. What's this? And then I'm just all fucked up for life, nigga. We good. But we all know mm-hmm. you're a freak. You don't stop for red lights anyway. So what difference does it make if she put it in your food? First of all, 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 first of all. I feel like I'm, I feel like it's a broken record. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Wipe the CD down again. Now start that over. Okay. Listen. First of all. Shit. Just first of all. Yo, how the fuck did we get this from home cooking? Chill. Yo, back to home cooking. Like I was saying, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this like, nigga is nasty like, nigga here. I like, I like, I like home cooking. Nasty, I like home cooking. Freak, I like, super freak. I, I like home cooking. I'm Yo, not from a now on, of... shut up. In our intro, when you introduce yourself, you need to be playing Rick James song. Shut up. <laughs> super freak. <laughs> yeah, super freak. Just for himself, though. I don't know what you're talking about. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! And I ain't talking about can't touch this food though. Damn, 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 damn. Listen, I'm just saying, home cooking, I fuck with it 100%. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I feel like it it is good to go out for night, get a meal, break. I don't really, I'm not a fast food guy, but I would like to go to a restaurant. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. So, I, all right. If yeah. you're doing home, I'm sorry, are you finished? Finish um, no, 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 go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. I wasn't, but yeah, go on. I want to hear what you have to say. All right. So say you have a, you know, you, you're on a date. You have a date. Would mm-hmm. you rather home cook food for the date or go out and eat for the date? I would rather go out and eat for the date. Cooking this bitch shit. No, honestly, like usually. <laughs> I don't know how they act in, in, in public. 
Can I honestly have a meatball thing? Who, who, I hate who, who dinner in a with? movie. Why don't people do dinner in a movie? I don't get that shit. Hmm. You get well, what I'm saying? No all right, I'm like, you said why do they do it? Yeah. Oh well, di- all right. Let me yeah. tell you. All right, explain this movie, to me. A movie, right? That's not what, what I said. Like, I said dinner in a movie. I'm breaking it down, bro. Okay. Calm yeah. down. All right, go Thank ahead. Thank you very much, sir. Uh-huh. So, all right, dinner in a movie. Dinner so a calm movie, down right? for he calm you down. See, I said dinner in a movie. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. You're not you're not catching it. I know what you're doing. Go I on. heard you say dinner in a movie. Yeah. I'm breaking down the one, because you can't do both at the same time. I do. What you talking about? You have dinner in the movie theater? First of all, actually, you do. Oh, you sit dinner. at your dinner table and watch a movie. First of all, listen, do, they do you have question. you have the Alamo Theater, you have the other one. They that don't they actually serve think? you no dinner. They serve you finger food. food. That's okay, not listen, dinner. Listen. What you got to say? All right. I'm <laughs> they not, serve I'm, you snacking all, food. Okay, listen. First, 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 shut up. Listen, let me talk to you. <laughs> you said shut up. <laughs> shut I'm up. Trying, I'm trying. You make me do these things to you. I'm saying he you said, can't shut up, eat like... and watch the movie. But I'm talking, I hate that people like to go and eat, then go see a movie. No. If anything, you should see the movie first so you have something to talk about during dinner, which is what I That's usually do. That's what I was trying but to you explain were, to you. But, but I'm talking about how people do the dinner and then the movie. You oh, were explaining it. That's what I was okay. See, okay, yeah, okay, That's okay, I kept I trying you. to stop you. I hate right, when people do it the calm. reverse way. All right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Nah, nah, man. He listen. said ding is calm. Ding is calm. First of all, stop using my fucking words, yo. Listen. That's why I said it. <laughs> How you, I hate when he used my words. <laughs> no, but here. Yeah, so this is why people do dinner than the movie. Yeah, I want to explain that. That makes no sense to me. But yeah, go. Why do they all do right. that? Dinner and a movie is two dates in one. So most men are trying, most men are trying, no, I can't even say this on air because I'm going to break the men code and I don't want the president of the men faculty to come look for me. So I'm going to just chill. All right. I don't want to break the, I don't want to break the men's code. All right. Without breaking the men's code. code. These these niggas left me when I got locked up the other time and they ain't come First of all, you know, damn well, ain't no niggas leave you when you got locked up. They is all on your body. I heard the, I heard the stories, nigga. This is this this nigga here, boy. Yeah, this Bash's Gossip here. Corner coming next episode. Get ready, Period look for that food. shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling all Period these niggas food. business. Fuck out of so here. This is, That's this right, is, bitch. Listen to me. This is what dinner in a movie. If when they do dinner first, yeah, the whole purpose is to assess the scenario. So really? I'm, and, and you know, I'm talking to Shorty. I'm getting to know Shorty. I'm trying to feel her out to see if after we eat is a kill. Mm. If I didn't seal the deal yet, then I'm going to add the movie on top because the movie is the cozy setting. You're not really doing much talking, but now I get to check and see how much bullshit she's going to let me get away with. Can I rub her thigh? Can I put my arm around her? Can I squeeze her body? Can Mm. I lean in for a kiss? We're in a movie. If she lets all of those things go through, then I know after this movie... I'm at a good fifty percent chance of a kill. <laughs> like, so I, I might just go in for kill gonna, tonight. I'm going. I'm going in for the kill shot. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna go for this kill shot. That's why you okay. people usually do dinner first, then the movie. Mm. But it should be movie and then dinner. Yes. Okay. All right. You understand what I'm saying? Oh yeah. But, that's how I do my shit. But I thought I was just fucked up in the game. All right. Nah, you do movie then dinner when you're already fucking with the chick. If it's your first date, you do dinner, then the movie. Because you want to get to know the girl, and you want to see, maybe I can eliminate spending more money and just go home and fuck. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But if that doesn't work, say you try it, and you're not getting the vibe that this is a go. Because not everybody is bold and just be like, yo, so what's up? We going back to the crib? Yeah, because nah, sometimes... They, you know, a lot of people play like they decent. Like a nigga want to act like he's a good good kind of guy yeah right so he's playing around and then he'll see all right she's not giving me the vibe like it's a kill let's go to the movies next now in the movie theater it's dark it's you know what i'm saying she already got a little bit of liquor in her let me fill her up real quick and see if she's letting it you know letting it pass let me see where we at by the time that movie is over it's either you got it or you got another date you gotta go through if you want to deal with it like yeah well i'll wait to date two 
this ain't like the white people shows where oh you nervous to kiss after this no niggas already planning to kill and she probably was planning to kill too my fault I just totally brought in a whole different topic inside of a topic I didn't mean to do that Uh we We talk more about dating than the fucking home cooked meals you realize that right (laughs) I'm so sorry you said you wanna go out and eat I asked what I'm cooking in the crib you cooking in the oh, crib? Oh, we got a date? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Of course. Because women don't think niggas could cook anyway. So that's already a surprise hit. Like, they're loving that. Oh, shit, you cooked? No, I didn't. I ordered Chinese food. I put it in a pot, warmed it up so you get the smell in the house. And now I'm serving it to you. That's what I really did. Damn. Thought I was special. Had a meal prepared and shit. That's good. That's all I need you to do is think you're special. So we can get that special sauce popping, and then uh, uh, uh. you can go home, and I can continue on with my life. Thank you. Mm. Okay. Mm. So I don't go out nowhere. Home cook food, <laughs> baby. Home cook food. I right, hear you. That was a that was a thing. That was definitely a thing. I don't home cook food, baby. Home cook food. I'm... Women do it too. Think about all the chicks you ever dated, and they decide I'm gonna cook for you. Nigga, she ain't cook for you because she like cooking, bro. And and why she was, cook? That was the ultimate this. plot. She want to show you that, okay, look, nigga, I'm homely. I'm the type of chick you can wife up. I got it. And then we're all doing everything. When you decide to feel like that, all that stop. It's going all that shit stop. It's over. <laughs> You know when I was married, how much motherfucking hero sandwiches I ate every day? <laughs> you know how many oh hero God. sandwiches I ate every day? That should oh be my over, God. bro. Over. Okay. It's quiet. And if I should call my ex and curse out just because. Oh, my God. I feel like you he really do that shit, though. Because he's crazy. That's yeah. just sad. Uh... <laughs> All right. that was, that was, uh, I don't even know, yo. Like that was uh, that was definitely a thing that I fucked with it. Uh, moving along. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I, yeah, home cooking. I don't know, nigga. Like that was just. Uh. Anyone else got anything want to say about home cooking? No. No. I'm Gucci on it. Yeah. No more. No more fucking rants from you, real quick. No tangents. Who me? Yeah. You. Yes, nigga. Yeah. That's why I asked you. I be already, sp- I be already explaining my my side. All right, <laughs> niggas, niggas know what time it is. If this my whole thing is with this podcast, I just want people to start being real with themselves. Let's stop being fake out here. You know what I'm speaking is the truth. That's a ski <laughs> fact. Thank you. All right. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. okay, okay. So with that being said. You know how we usually do before we go to the third the third topic. I'm going to take a little moment right here real quick. And I just really want to say one more time, which I always like to do, is thank all of you for coming back and just being here with us for another round. I know sometimes we're a little much, but you fucks with us and we fucks with you. At least I hope y'all fuck with us. Whether it's good energy or bad energy, we 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 are all with all the fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna stop us from doing what we want to do. We family. We love each other through all of this bullshit. Some of us is easier to get rid of than others. You know what I'm saying, Val? But yeah, um, third time. You know what? You know what? <laughs> no, 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 no. I was being nice. I was being nice. No, no. You was expecting the ski. I can't keep hitting ski. I gotta give him a break. You know what I'm saying? Let me let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Try from ass, bash. Damn, yo, you, see you ain't shit? shit, and you ain't gonna never be shit. And you I just want every shit? listener to know: never trust Badge because he will steer you wrong every fucking turn. Damn, son. Yeah. Y'all hit, y'all hit, y'all hit a love like yeah in this motherfucker. Yeah, that's all love for you, right there. Because you ain't shit. Damn. <laughs> all right. Well, now that now that I'm all thoroughly hurt, shall we good, get to good, the next good. topic, which is like this piece of shit, nigga, birth control? Yeah, next topic birth is birth control. control. Yeah, for third topic. Topic of birth control. I don't even birth care. Control. My feelings are hurt. <laughs> I hope I hope you catch all the kids, nigga. Fuck you. Oh, Ooh, you? You nigga. Oh no! Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. 
No, this nigga don't, don't even wear no about condoms. That. But, all right, so nigga, I wear condoms. Oh, I wear oh, condoms oh, every time. That nigga, oh, <laughs> that, nigga oh. that nigga be raw dog and more than ski. You don't know? Oh, okay. Well, oh. People don't believe in birth control. Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I believe first in birth of all, control. I wear condoms. Sorry, I don't know what the fuck bash I'm on. That nasty nigga don't. Yo, why the fuck we always gotta keep putting? Yo, I'm gonna be real with he you. Said, he said, he said, if his dick, he said, if his dick gonna catch it, his mouth gonna catch it too. Yo. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Yo, first of all, y'all yo. niggas on here is so flagrant, yo. yo. Man, this shit in here is just atrocious. Yo. Like, I wouldn't want my kids to listen to this podcast. This yo. shit right here is this fucking is an explicit crazy. podcast. Please do yo. not have your children. Listen oh to my this. god. So, <laughs> what the fuck? You know so what all the you, characters have to do? My, <laughs> my <laughs> version of the game was a regular game. I have to get a whole new host. A whole new editor that can kiss my ass. Yo, the character assassination, I'm tired of being followed up by freak nasty Wait, but Bash, that sounds, yo, Bash, I'm not even gonna hold you. That just sounds like you, bro. I know, I don't meat, like condoms. I don't wear them, but you ain't it, had to do Then your mouth like catch it? <laughs> yo, what? Listen. I know. I was not ready for that. that was, yo. See, this nigga had a rhyming scheme and everything. He ain't shit. Yo, Yo yeah, so this is a my lot, last episode. But you see that round. that thing women like to say, dirty dick ass nigga, that's you. Uh, <laughs> that's you. Yeah, that's so you, bro. Is, that's this is you. my last episode of another round. It's a pleasure to meet all you people out there in the internet land or whatever the fuck y'all <laughs> listen to me on. You know what I'm saying? If you catch me, never. Fucking get you know, from all these fake niggas over here. Next episode oh, of another round is officially going to be called Fakes. It will be introduced by a whole nother nigga because I ain't here no more. Fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, yo. That's crazy. Yo, Val, you ain't shit for throwing him out there like that neither, bro. Yeah, whatever. Just, don't care. I'm going to make don't sure care. you don't know my business, nigga. <laughs> don't <laughs> care. <laughs> Your business? <laughs> Y'all niggas on here is dangerous, yo. Yo, what the fuck is you telling? Niggas making depositions on motherfuckers. We should have did the snitch segment right now. Fuck out of here. Yo, son. that's for real. This nigga threw your whole shit outside, landlord. Mm-hmm. Damn. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Vel, oh. birth control, right? You're. Mm-hmm. Nah, fuck you, niggas. Uh-huh. I don't, I don't want to hear from them more. Give me somebody else. I'm, I'm <laughs> don't give me that. I don't care. I, I, I don't care. I use God, nigga. Don't care. Nigga don't care. Don't care. Don't get so, mad, nigga. So, wait, Produce so, a condom. Produce a condom right now. I'm gonna go to the store and get one for you right now, <laughs> nigga. Suck he my said produce one right now. <laughs> like, nigga, you ain't even right got now. one. No. I got one in my wallet right now, nigga. You ain't got no, not listen, one. Shut up. So, birth control. <laughs> you prefer con- like condoms over the female taking like a birth control concept or some stupid. I don't know. My head hurt. Who Someone was that else directed told. to? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> oh, oh my shit, my words man, broke. I don't want to talk no so more. Well, as for myself, hi Mika. <laughs> you know, as for myself, I feel comfortable with the man having condoms and stuff. He take control of the birth control of the situation. I I have no problems with that. I'm okay that he takes control of that. I'm cool on it. I mean, we could see you got 12 kids. The fuck? Bitch, you's a fucking wow. liar. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Why I gotta be a bitch? Why I gotta be a bitch? Y'all you niggas out here is flagrant, bro. I don't understand what's lie. that. Bash is the only good person on here. The rest of you Don't try to get um, a good intro man. now, nigga. Fuck out of oh, here. It's too late. We are like five episodes in, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you you ain't got a good one yet, and I haven't either. So I so I, sorry, we were stuck here. I gave here. you one. I'm pretty sure. No, you have not. Uh, no, you have not. Uh. <laughs> yo, the the, clo- the close me, the closest the closest one I got was yeah, just I, that nigga Vale. That's just it. Just that nigga Vale. That's the best one you're gonna get from me ever. Just yeah, that whatever, nigga. nigga. Whatever. Just that nigga. Yo, nah, nah, nah. at least your name gets mentioned in the intro. <laughs> I don't even get my name mentioned anymore in the intro, yo. He don't even mention my name. 
yo, yo, I'm like three episodes in, talk. niggas don't know who I am, yo. Like, <laughs> That's right, can't stop. Oh, man. Yo. Yo, Ski, that is super foul. You might want to talk to somebody about that. That is super foul, nigga. And, and, that, and that's crazy. The only person that gets a good one is Mika. The only one. And she the worst one out of all of us. Oh, Never. my God. No, I'm Never. not. And, and think no, about God. this. Think about this. And Bash always talking about how nice and sweet she is and the, the person to look up to or whatever. Or that. But every time she has a, that y'all have y'all segment, he has not agreed with her not one time. Every not time you get the fucking time. First of all, we know he, we know that bell. We know that fake. We already know that. We already know that. But yeah, yo, like he's always giving her the, the most, the beautiful. And the, fuck all that. Yo. Damn. That's she's crazy. the most. Yo, you, you know that. Yo, I don't even want to keep talking. I'm getting tight. This shit don't even make getting this. tight. This shit don't even make no sense. My name, your belt, at least he says your name. <laughs> I'd rather him be like, this stupid motherfucker ski. He don't even say ski. <laughs> he just says, yeah, and him. Anyway, we all go on to... Yeah, and him. I'm sorry. That was, that was Yo, good. That nigga don't got no... That's the problem. I told you, he's the type of nigga you'll torture his family. You won't even fucking touch him. <laughs> Yeah. His little brother go to school. You give his little brother wedgies all week. He said you give him wedgies. <laughs> and beat his head. Wedgies all week, and then tell him this is your brother fault. And then mm-hmm. let the brother go tell the mother, and the mother just be beating the shit out of Bass every day because he's a piece of shit. Damn, that's crazy. Shit, crazy. It what the is. hell is the topic? Because we went straight off that. Shit. Yeah, it was birth, birth control. control. So who's Sorry. talking about birth? Is you Val? What was you? No, about I finished. Birth I finished. I finished. I... You and him have to say what y'all need to Wait, say. Wait, Mika, what did you say about birth control? I said I don't have a problem with it. And you said I had twelve kids. I said, bitch, you's a lie. And that's the last thing we was on. Oh, I did remember you cursing me out. I don't know why. All I, <laughs> all I ever do is love you. I don't understand oh, why you. Oh my god! Here me. we go. I don't understand why you always come. You starting to act like that. Here like this we Bash. go. Here we go. Bash, how you feel about birth control, bro? I don't want to talk to none of you niggas no more. Oh. I just exist. I don't oh. feel no type of way. Go ski. Oh, shit. You see how niggas be acting when you tell a nigga the truth about himself? If I don't say nothing, y'all can't use shit against me. No, I can't use any of the sitting in the dark, <laughs> in the corner, all alone, <laughs> puffing and pouting. <laughs> Fuck your feelings, nigga. Yeah. Fuck wrong yeah. with you. Oh, my fucking head hurts. Oh, oh my, <laughs> oh, my head hurts, too. Chill, chill, chill. All right, no, go, Ski. You know, I'm going to go last. I'm going to go last. I'm going to go last. All right. Well, it all depends on what birth control niggas is, uh, people are trying to use because there's plenty different birth control methods. They got females, they got males that, uh, you know, you can collect birth control. I'm with the birth control because, Bash, I'm like you. When I get in a relationship, gloves off. Mm. Back, like, I'm not, I'm not really mm-hmm. trying to, I'm not really trying to rainbow up, but at least it's done healthy. Like, we both get checked. Even though you still can't trust a motherfucker regardless, but we both get checked mm-hmm. and then our intimacy level goes up another notch. So, you know, gloves off and I want to make sure you are right. So, yeah, get on the pill. If you need to take the depot shot, go get you the depot shot. Mm-hmm. We go to like and then I could just keep getting charged for attempt murder all the time. Mm. I just be beating mm-hmm. the case because I shot an empty club up. Only the mm-hmm. bouncer was there. You feel me? Only That's the bouncer was say. there. I respect yeah. that. I respect that. Okay, cool. That's how I feel. That's how you yeah. feel? That's how I feel. That's how I feel. All right. Now, on me. Yes, I do not like condoms. I am not an advocate for condoms. I think that they're atrocious. They're an abomination against God. I my dick is the most important person to me in my life and somebody that precious to me I should listen listen me and that nigga 
First of all, me and that nigga been through war. We been we both been through some gunfire. Both of us have been shot up. We both been burned. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. We both recovered together, nigga. That's my I'm just gonna, for life. I'm gonna say this real. I'm gonna say this real quick. Just I'm not. I'm sorry. I'll be throwing you off of what you're saying. Mm-hmm. But in all actuality, God honest truth, as my brother. And you know I fucks with y'all. I don't want to know nothing about your manhood. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you are giving me stories about your your, your manhood. I don't want to know about that nigga. Right, I got listen. my own. That's Thank it. you. Okay. My fault. I get you. I get he you. said I got my. Right. He said I got my own man. Without this interrupting ass nigga, I digress. As much as yo I want. yo. I'm not going to tell you again oh with my the big God. fucking words, bro. Okay, as as okay, condoms bad. Me no likey condoms. I... <laughs> <laughs> oh man, <laughs> that is the simplest way he can put that. <laughs> Nigga said me no likey condoms. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. That's the simplest way he could put that. Oh. Yo, that was fucking funny. Oh, oh man. Nah, go ahead, that, man. Sorry. Go that ahead. was me catering to the simple niggas out there. You know what I'm saying? That was, was to the simple niggas. But again, I get that condoms are like probably, I'm not going to say the most effective form of birth control, but I don't like women when they take like the pill and like, oh, the depot shot. Like, I, I ain't going to cry. If I have to, I will wear a condom even if I don't want to because I don't like it when women take those type of birth controls because it affects their moods, it affects their body balance chemically and all of that shit. Like, because the only thing birth control literally does is mimic signs of menopause. And my bitch already crazy. I don't want her going through all that shit. So if I got to throw a condom on every now and then, I'll take the hit even though I don't want to. But I know some women use birth control to regulate their periods and shit like that. But it is a lot of side effects to birth control, man. If if she's not comfortable taking it, then it's up to me to step up and be like, fuck it, I'm going to put this condom on. I don't think it's staying on the whole time, but I'm going to put it on for you, you know, to make you feel better about it. But it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? I hear you. Yo, they say the best um, birth control is abstinence. Yes, I yes. tell people the best birth control is her mouth. Her mouth? Mm. I've never mm. heard anybody get pregnant from their mouth. Hmm. So Dude, you ain't doing it right. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I drop mm. off and keep it moving. Dinner time. Mm. Mm. And um, and that's that. You feel me? So the birth whole birth control scenario is solved right there. That's true. I mean, I, I can't disagree with the nigga. I mean, hey, it is what it is. And that seemed like it went by really fast. I ain't even gonna hold you. Like, <laughs> I feel like we all pretty much just agree with this. I hate when we all agree on some shit. Like, real talk, because that shit went by super quick. But, okay. Alright, so that was, that, was, that was birth control, people. Any final thoughts or things on birth control? Nah, no, I'm good. I'm good. Okay. You good with your birth control? You don't. You, you, what you say anyway about birth control? I don't fucking remember. He said he like condoms. Said. Oh yeah, he said he said he fuck with condoms. He, he said he like condoms. So you you don't you don't have unprotected sex. No. Your condom is your birth control. Yep. Oh okay. And you know what? I I, I swear to God, I hundred percent believe this nigga that he don't that he wear condoms. Like he don't do the unprotected sex because if you've ever met this nigga, he is so obsessed with socks, nigga. And like, if he's willing to put him that there, then I'm I'm pretty sure he got like a whole different type of condom game from niggas. I'm just saying. Hey, yeah, this nigga <laughs> says socks. Leave my socks alone, you bitch. <laughs> no, you going too far now. <laughs> you going too far now, bitch. Oh man. Damn. So I'll kill you. I'll ki- so to quickly stare off topic, Vel, you got a a sock fetish? Uh, I don't have a sock fetish. <laughs> I just like my socks though a lot. Mm, a lot, nigga. It's more than the lot. average man. Way more than the oh, average man. Cause, cause no, I do, I just don't I don't wear plain socks. Oh, you like the colorful designers and all that stuff like that? 
Yeah, all my socks that I own are either colorful um, characters or something like that. Yeah, I spend money on socks. Yeah, like money, like outfit money on socks for no reason. But nah, but there's 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 a I, whole. I used to have a sock fetish. There's like a whole that. thing for that. all types mm-hmm. of socks and long socks, short socks. No, all, all, socks. all my socks are long. Wait, let me pay attention right now. What kind of socks do I have on? My socks you, right now are you black match with your socks to your briefs. Sometimes, sometimes depending on how I'm feeling. Oh, it's a fancy date with you. Pull your things yeah. off. You got Mac. Yeah. So your socks with briefs is like a girl's matching bra and panty set. <laughs> Yo, okay. Talk, okay. We, we gotta definitely nope. talk about okay. that because no. Bra yeah. and panties is so. Oh my god. Fuck birth control then. <laughs> you didn't fuck mm-hmm. birth control. Mm, mm, oh. mm. Alright, so what's the next show? We got what is it in the cut? Yeah, I don't want to announce in the cut. Someone else do it. Oh. What? How you can <laughs> you you have to no. announce it. You're the announcer, you know that, right? Seriously, I have to do all of it. Oh. Yeah. I don't wanna announce this shit somebody else did. <laughs> like that's well, not how I it goes. Announce, I can announce my Go goddamn ahead. segment. Nah. My no, segment, our nah. segment, me nah. and ski segment. Next uh, in the cut is coming up right uh, now. Get ready, get set, go. Nah, 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 <laughs> get ready, get set, go. Yeah, and you other other two niggas just shut the hell up. Nah, nah. First of all, let me announce this shit properly. I apologize. No, no, no. We don't want. We don't even want. We don't, we don't want to no chop proper announcement now. Like we have moved nah, on from okay. that. So, fans, please hit us up at another round podcast <laughs> eight oh eight at gmail dot com mm-hmm. slash. Get bashed the fuck up out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I like how niggas know the fucking email address when it comes to getting me the fuck out of here. Get bashed the fuck up out of here. Alright. Okay. So, now, of course, as you probably heard before, we get into the part of the podcast where we get to the in the cut segment where it's going to be Ski and Mika going through a debate back and forth. And they're going to have a specific topic that they've chosen. And me and Vel at the end are going to see which one of them we side with. And of course, we're going to want your feedback. We're going to want to know what you guys think and who you guys think actually won the debate. Because without y'all, none of this is possible. And right now, let's get ready for In the Cut. Do we need like some music intro? Like, we, 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 we should, we should, we should. Yeah, we're gonna get up guitar. Right? I, don't li- I don't really like the way he introduced nothing I got a part of. You understand? <laughs> Yo, I swear, next episode, I'm not doing the fucking intro. So, I don't know which one of y'all niggas want to take that. Next nigga doing the intro for all of that you shit. You barely do the shit now. Who cares? I do it. It's, 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 first of all, my intro is just fire. Just because you ain't in them don't mean shit. No, 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 because you ain't in them. You got a problem. My intro is yeah. fire, nigga. Just because you ain't in, in them don't mean shit. Now, in the mm-hmm. cut. So, what are we cutting about today? What? Ladies first. <laughs> well, are we talking about two science? Tube tie-in. That, that's a touchy subject for some. And what were we talking about? The guy getting a little snippy snip? We was going to debate about that. Oh, is that what you call it? A little snippy snip? Yeah, a little snippy snip. Like, the guy's getting a little snippy snip. So, the the last show I went first and won. So, why don't you go now? <laughs> Wait, did you just say you won? <laughs> last Wait, show what? I won. Wait, so, how did you... How did you? Anyway, all right. Well, we could talk about that off air. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I, got I, don't, I don't know where you caught a victory at, but okay. <laughs> okay. So, so it's supposed to be a vasectomy. Vasectomy. Versus two side or herectomy? How do you pronounce that? Herectomy? A tube ligation? No, a tube ligation or. Oh, a hysterectomy. Hysterectomy. I, uh, apologies, ladies. I'm sorry. <laughs> hysterectomy? I okay. call it a... All right. So, vasectomy. I believe women should just get the 
hysterectomy. No, no, not the hysterectomy. Ooh. The the tube ligation. Okay, and why did you feel that way? Um, let me tell you why I feel that way. <laughs> why do you feel that way? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Women are already are set to go through this uh, pain of delivery and life bringing and all that, right? Mm-hmm. So you already put on the table when you go get your GYN test. They're already inside of you, checking you out, doing all sorts of things. Mm-hmm. So it's just an easier, simpler operation to just go in there, slip, cut burn whatever they do and clip off your tools it is more evasive to cut a man's scrotum to get to the tubes that produce the semen that shoots out the penis why the fuck am I letting you cut my balls if she don't want to have any kids then she needs to get her thing done if I don't want to have no kids I'll just up and leave when they're born Mm, 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 Thank you. So I'm supposed to be debating that? <laughs> I'm supposed to be debating this? I mean, I don't make it. You can't debate me at all, but I mean, try to figure something to say. You know what I'm saying? So, what? So, basically, I'm supposed to be like. What's the pros of having a, a vasectomy? Ooh, uh, you lost already. <laughs> you done out here. <laughs> I'm you just, just, I'm you're, just, I'm, I'm, you're I'm, done I'm out just here. Like trying to um, the pros of having a vasectomy. Um. Well, they can't run around and have a million kids. You know the pros of it. Um, if they have health reasons. You know, sperm, low sperm count is a really touching thing for a man. So if they done try or they like to have kids, you know, they don't want to keep trying. They might as well just shut shit down, cut, cut, cut all that shit out. And then, um, like, ooh, the pros are whatever. Um, uh, I, I really don't have nothing else. <laughs> I don't have nothing else about it. Like I don't have nothing else about it. Now the so, disadvantage, I, I believe, <laughs> the disadvantage of that, you know, they can have the vasectomy, but it doesn't protect against sexually transmitted infections. So they still can listen, catch them. I was always told if you play in the dirt, you might come up with ringworms. Oh my god. <laughs> That sounds horrible, but you know, you know, I, I, I feel either side. It's like the heavy being a tube side. That's a touchy subject for some women, cause I feel like you know, women, we already be our whole system is what keeps the world going. And I feel like you know, when you have to cut your tubes, you know, that's a a bad thing. I wouldn't want to see no woman go through that. But also, I wouldn't want to see no man having to give up trying to make some more babies and repro- re- you know, reproduce. So that's what I gotta say on that subject. <laughs> subject is such That's what I gotta say. So what you what you trying to tell me is you agreeing with what I'm saying then? So I won basically because you really didn't tell me much or nothing. I- and I <laughs> gave you a whole I gave you a whole rundown on why women should do it and not men. You understand what I'm saying? What you just said, you kind of agreed with me. And then didn't agree at the same time. You sound like you lost. <laughs> Yo. Well, that debate was one-sided because you wow. made some valid points. So, I don't feel like entertaining you. So, yeah. You won you that one. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. Everything he said was wrong. You know what? Ski wins. Ooh. Ski, Ski absolutely wins. Everything that nigga said was complete, <laughs> utter bullshit, which he just <laughs> his For the record, uh, what is that? A tubal, a, a tubal ligation or whatever it's called is way more fucking invasive. Don't say whatever it's called. Because I don't, it's I, I, I can't, I can't. It's a tubal ligation. A vas- 
two, of vasectomy, no, it's, it's right? It's two words. It's a tubal ligation. It's not like that. It's two words. It's not That's one word. That's what I just said. A tubal you said ligation. a tubal ligation. No. The two, all right. So a tubal, tubal, tubal ligation. Tubal ligation is way more invasive. Way more invasive than a vasectomy? Vasectomy, yes. It is way more fucking invasive than a Says the motherfucker who ain't never had it. Shut up. Oh, <laughs> again, way more fucking invasive than getting a vasectomy. It is a major surgery, unlike a fucking vasectomy. And yes, sometimes a vasectomy is reversible on its own because it's not shit. If you are Damn, actually considering like getting that procedure done, don't listen to us because it is a major procedure if you want to get listen your to me started. don't cut your Please, balls no, bro no look Mika, at your dog i swear to look god Mika, you could have won that one son like real talk your dog everything your he's done was suffering forced. right now i wanted I, I wanted i wanted you to win so bad because you had the right on all of this shit like um <laughs> god damn seriously you she had did, this one was she yours was, she wasn't caring about it Damn, I, I, apparently, her heart wasn't um, into it. She won't yeah. into it tonight. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm genuinely I, sad. I wanted her to get this win, nigga. This W would have been hers. Like, yo, I, what the I, hell? Well, first of all, stop fucking hating. She I'm wasn't not... getting no W. I didn't <laughs> see nothing wrong. I said everything correct. Don't fucking cut your balls, man. Let your yo. woman cut her fucking tubes. The fuck. Yes. Yes, let her take major surgery, you inconsiderate pieces of shit. Now, Yo, yes, she's already on the table giving birth. The doctor's going to ask, oh my would you like to tie me? You on your, you on your seventh kid, you hoe. Would you oh. like to, would you like to tie your two? This is your ninth baby father with your seventh kid. Can't. Would you like to tie these tubes? And I can't yes, I them. would. Tie that. Everybody, them. please, please understand oh, that another round podcast does not. And I, I repeat that strongly with capital letters. Does not <laughs> believe the views that Ski is saying right now. No, 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 hell no. You can't say that when you concede it to him already. Nah, fuck yeah. that. That shit he's saying right now is out uh, of this world. It's it's actually not. It's what niggas be thinking about. Why you think Vel strap up all the time? He not giving no hold, no baby. Oh my goodness. But if uh, if he went with her and she actually tied her tubes and he knew for a fact, he wouldn't strap up. You think Vel care about STDs? He don't give a fuck about an STD. I actually oh do. Oh my god. That nigga just nigga. don't wanna. He just don't want nigga. no stupid chick to have no kid for him. That's all. Nigga, I I, I am thirty something years old. I ain't never had an STD, nigga. I join the club. I'm older than you. I'm good. What happened? What are we talking about? And I've played <laughs> myself plenty of times. You know how many times I've taken this HIV test and was sitting there crying? Like, I know I got something. <laughs> I know it. But he said he's sitting there crying. I know this doctor's going to call me in two days and tell me it's over. I know that shit. What? Hmm. Mm, mm, mm. So, anybody, I mean, Mika, you ever had anything? Yeah, no. that's a whole different topic. Hey, hey, we go. Hey, fuck it. He brought it up. <laughs> I fucking run with it. <laughs> no, I ain't even doing it. I ain't even doing it. Fuck it. Leave it alone. I, 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 no, I, I, I thought we were gonna make it. it a whole topic. Nah, you want? We can run with it. No, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. I'm just good. I just had to say something. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, I'm done. I have well, not. Back. In my 39 years of living, have not. Nigga, you're lying. You just gave that nigga <laughs> fucking philosophy. Shut up. What the what? fuck is philosophy? That's some African <laughs> shit? <laughs> Yo, oh my God. Like y'all some... niggas, niggas on his wild races. I'm not even <laughs> Yo. That's all like I'm some shit that come from old. where you from. Yo, yeah. y'all is wild racist. Everything gotta be an African thing, huh? But I'm right. saying though, no, that sound that don't sound American. Hmm. Falafel. What the fuck did you say? A falafel? You hungry? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> All right, so are we gonna end this show? Bash, um sum us up please. Um y'all, y'all are just too ignorant. Sure, why not? I'm gonna sum sum us up. Yeah, so today we talked about stuff. 
And <laughs> Yo, I'm glad you said stuff. <laughs> No, 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 no. I mean, I really hope everybody enjoyed this episode. I appreciate you all, all you guys coming and just bullshitting with us like we usually do. We talked about divorce. Yeah, briefly, I guess. Home cooking. Get out is, quick. Like, yeah, like divorce, I guess, is just something we all kind of fuck with. We ain't really go off too far in it. Home cooking just... I don't know. Today we weren't on topic for shit, and I apologize for that. Like we were just all over the place. We we gonna work on it a little better next time. We gonna have a whole new host. You know what I'm saying? We gonna we gonna have a whole new host for y'all in this bitch. You know what I'm saying? We got y'all. We gonna have somebody over here that do it apparently better than me. You know what I'm saying? Um, we talked about birth control and a horrible in the cut, which just was just no, no. Mm -hmm. Just yeah, yeah that's how yeah. I felt about it the whole time. That's how the fuck you sum up the show, bro. Uh, Son, this show was yo, horrible uh, to me. I'm sorry, my another bad. Another round podcast. <laughs> the show was eight oh eight at gmail.com. Shoot bash in the motherfucking head. Hashtag. Shoot bash. Oh, wow, my nigga. Shoot him oh. in the motherfucking face. My fault. Oh. I'm sorry. Nah, oh. so like we, so we did not stay on topic for shit. We, I don't know. Mm -hmm. No, good episode. Good episode, team. Good episode. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That smoke crack and get high. So <laughs> that. Smoke crack Climbing every day. Balls in the corner. Smoke crack every day. So, yeah. That's crazy. Um, Vel, please take us out of here so we can put this one in the books. Okay. Um, just have a nice night, and this was just terrible. It <laughs> was. <laughs> Another round, ho. <laughs> Another round. This nigga. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs>